are continuing now with the coverage of that winter storm heading up the East Coast. Dominion Virginia power crews left early this morning for the Northeast. Their task to help restore power in blizzard conditions. Not an easy task at that. Here in Hampton Roads, the rain and wind was the worst of it. And your side's Ann McNamara has been following the weather closely for us today. She's live from Portsmouth. Ann? Tom, puddles like this are all we have left of that heavy rain this morning, but that storm has moved to the northeast, and so have crews from Dominion Virginia Power. They say, if necessary, they're ready to work 16-hour shifts for the next two weeks. For Dominion and Virginia Power, this workday started earlier than most. Crews from Hampton Roads in North Carolina packed for a two-week trip to New Jersey, where a winter storm is expected to knock out power to thousands of homes. There's a lot of wire down, you know, broken poles, trees down usually from all the weight. Lineman Sean Warrior has been on trips like this before, so he knows what to expect and, more importantly, what to bring to keep himself warm. You know, these are just some of the boots like we wear. Highly insulated. And these are what we work in when we're up in the air and on the ground. And sleeves also. While they were packing, heavy rain fell across Hampton Road, stranding drivers and making for a slow morning commute. Yeah, don't drive, stay in the house. This woman waited out the rain, but when she finally came out, the wind made her hold on to her hat. Uh, when you come around the corner there, it sort of gets you the wind. It was kind of upping the hat, yeah, right in the face. Have you lost it yet today? No, no. I pull it down so it stays, it stays pretty much. The wind is all that's left of a storm that's already made its way to the northeast. I, I'm sorry they're getting it, but better them than us. And right behind the storm, Dominion crews on their way to help with the cleanup to get the power on for their new northern friends. It's a great feeling to get people on, especially when they thank you. And I'm sure they'll be grateful to have them. I've been talking to people out and about all day who have friends, family, relatives in the northeast, and they say at last check they had almost 10 inches, but in some spots they're expecting three feet of snow. Live in Portsmouth, I'm in McNamara, 10 on your side.